Okay, I have to gather my thoughts a little bit. Are you going to ask me questions? Uh, yes. Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. Are you going to ask questions? or? I am just going to ask you a brief question. Can you tell me your name and how long you've known him? Uh, Marilyn Falconer. I've known her close to two years. Sharon Burke. So I've known her over a year now. I'm Joni Steinman and I've known Ann um, not quite three years. It's probably more like two and a half years. I'm Angie Reiner. I've probably known her, I'm not sure, five, seven years, I think she's been in our church. Man, she just puts me to shame in so many ways. She has so much energy. She is halfway to 156 or somewhere in there. She's 78, I believe. And Anne is one of the friendliest people I know. And she's always made me feel so welcome. Anne has a joyful spirit about her, and she draws you um, to her by her um, fun-loving way of life. She is the most giving person of her time and her things, and um, if you need something, Anne's right there. I'm so encouraged by this lady and I'm so privileged to know her and to be working with her and just to have her friendship. Even when I'm at church, she makes a special um, effort to come up and say hi to me and um, the more I know her, the more things I see that are really good about her. but an attitude also that Jesus Christ is in control of her life and she wants to share that with others. I just really enjoy how open she is, her sense of humor. Uh, if you could describe Anne in one word, what would it be? Oh boy. First word that comes to mind is enthusiasm. <laughs> <laughs> I see the love in Anne that she also shares with other people. I think what's um, been fun about her is her her perspective of life um, allows us to have laughs and share joy. Does so many things. I love how she reaches out to so many people, um, to her neighbors. She's constantly looking for ways to serve people. Uh, just recently, she has a, a friend across the driveway from her in this complex and she's been he's been down with uh, sickness and she has been bringing breakfast and um, she just does that all the time she's helping sisters all the time in the church uh, helping them out a lot of times we'll just exchange a smile it's like she always knows what's going on and what's making you uh, smile about something and she's just a precious friend.